What's up, Pasadena? How you guys doing? I'm from New York. Yeah. Yeah, I'm Italian. Yeah, yeah. You know, growing up in... Hey, can you answer that? Thank you. I love when they bring phones to my show. Is it, is it my wife? Yeah. You know, growing up Italian in New York, we were tough as kids. Yeah. In my neighborhood, we didn't have an ice cream truck. We had the ambulance. If you got out of line, you got the flavor of the week. Yeah. You know, kids today, they got it easy. You know? <laughs> Nowadays, child abuse. Child abuse, right? You call it child abuse? Abuse was the way my parents showed love. That's part of being raised Italian. They're not slapping you around. It's like, what? You don't love me no more. <laughs> what? Jesus, Dad, Ma, she doesn't like me. Yeah. We used to call it being raised right. If you weren't dizzy after your father talked to you, <laughs> you weren't learning anything. <laughs> you talking to me? Are you talking to me? Uh, Dad, I'm three. I'm just learning to talk. <laughs> yeah. I gotta tell you, my mother, she's so religious, right? She wear out a set of rosary beads. If you use the curse word in my house, she'd bless a glass of water and throw it in your face. <laughs> you think it's easy, huh? She blessed everything. She blessed the food before cooking it, you know? Of course, my father had to add his two cents. Helen, don't overbless it. You overbless it, it loses its taste. You know, growing up with this religious mom, right? You don't do normal things. You know, instead of baseball cards, trading cards, we had holy cards. <laughs> you know? Hey, uh, the, other, the other kids in the neighborhood are trading Mickey Mantle, right? I got one St. Teresa, Holy Average, five Hail Marys, and two professionals. Hey, you got Louis DeBrasco's funeral card? He blessed the line, took four bets, two chairs, one iron pipe through the window and box seats. <laughs> he had a bad year. I got Madonna. Yeah. The original. <laughs> hey, she's not religious, is she? Of course she is, like a virgin. <laughs> you know, once I open my mouth, people think I'm connected. You know? Not the phone company. <laughs> and they say the stupidest things. Are you in the mafia? No! But my friends and family, huh? <laughs> People think just because you're Italian, just because you got kind of a tough attitude, just because I got three refrigerators, <laughs> just because every now and then I buy a lot of cement, <laughs> and just because I got two Cadillacs, four Lincolns in my driveway, and just because I got cable, and I don't pay. <laughs> they think I'm a wise guy, that's stupid. You didn't think that was funny? I know where you live. Yeah. Hey, you should see our family pictures. Yeah. Yeah, this is uh, my Uncle Joey's going away party. This is my grandmother at Uncle Joey's going away party. <coughs> yeah, you know. What's up with directory assistants? Are these people stupid or what? You know, people have trouble with Italian names, you know? I have to spell everything out for them. Simple names like Harry the Hat, Frankie No Shoes. Johnny Milk Duds, Johnny Pocket Change, Tony the Tiger, Bobby Don't Live Here No More. Simple names like that. You didn't think it was funny? Frankie, seal the doors. Yeah. You know, yeah, my dad, right, even though he was tough, you know, he did teach me something. 
You know, he always taught me the vowels. Everybody knows their vowels, right? Yeah. A, E, I, O, U. Forget about it. Thank you very much. Have a nice night. I'll be at the improv on the 28th of June.